Okay, so first is kailangan muna nating evaluate yung buong expression to know kung ano yung schema na ilalagay natin. But for this expression, isa lang yung connective doon sa mga groupings, which is the implies. Now, ipare-pareho sila ng variables, sino yung mauuna sa kanila? Ang mauuna sa kanila ay ito. For the reason na may not yun. Next is, B na to pareho. So, ito yung not B natin. Now, we'll be having P, Q, true, true, false, false, true, false, true, false, and then meron tayong not P, which is false, false, true. Now, unahin natin yung A natin. this expression. Not P implies Q. Tingnan nyo lang to. That is true false. Yun lang yung false natin. And then true na lahat. Next is kuhanin natin yung B. So, P implies Q yung original. So, true false is false. And then, true na. Tapos, isunod natin tong not B. That is, false, true, false, false. Now, based on the groupings, sino ba yung magkasama dyan? Tingnan natin to. At saka ito. So, sila yung magkasama. Meron tayong not B and B. So, combining and tayo. So, meron tayong False, 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 false. Kasi sa end review, magkakawal lang tayo ng true. Pagparehong true yung values nila. Now, tingnan ulit natin itong groupings. At saka ito. Pag pinagsama natin, so ito naman yung sunod natin. So meron tayong not B and B or A. So, combining ito at saka yung value nito. Or so, true 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 false. <coughs> Makakuha lang tayo ng false value doon if P and Q are both false. So, ito yun. The best is true. And then, kasya pa naman. No? So, meron na tayo. Tapos na tayo dito sa groupings. Okay. So, ito, Pag, pagkat binilang natin 1, 2, 3 4, 5 1, 2, 3 4, 5 ito hindi na kailangan now rewrite ulit natin we'll be having not B and B or A implies not P. Okay. Now, 
ito implies not p so true implies false is false false true true okay so ito yung final natin at saka ito true false is false true false is false true true is true false true is true now this is an, an introduction before our final lesson which is yung tautologies contradictions at saka contingent now makakakuha lang tayo ng contradiction value this is a contradiction value Oh, sorry, sorry. This is a contingent value. Kasi combination ng true at saka false yung nakuha natin. Pag ganito yung given. Pero once na nakakita kayo ng given ni Sir Nag, uh, P, Q is equal to true, R, S is equal to false, ang makukuha nyo lang lagi dung final answer ay true or false. So, pag true, yun yung contradiction. Pag false, yun ay contingent. So, I will move to our final topic, which is the checking by trees method.